Rescue Command to Rescue Team Bravo. Have you finished your grids? The Rescue Team Bravo, finishing it now. Hi, uh, can you find out where your search groups are at and get back to me? Sure. Oh, good, thanks. OK, we'll get on to the next sector. Simon Freswich has been missing for 48 hours. We need to find him before dark. Yeah, got it. Rescue Team Bravo out. Robert just doesn't want to be found. Crossbreakers are notoriously cagey. Well, surely he'd at least call to say he's OK. Who knows? Anyway, you pack up the ropes and me and Chase will do a final sweep. You pack them. What? Chase and I will do the final sweep. You pack up the ropes. What's the big deal? Well, if it's not a big deal, you do it. You do it. You do it. You. Uh, I'll do it if it's going to Oh, be. no, it's fine. I'll do it. Off you go in your little boys club. Have fun. What the hell was that about? Married life, mate. Rescue command to rescue team Alpha. Rescue team Alpha. We've completed our search of sector 439. Heading into sector 438, over. Rescue command, copy that. I've got SES groups moving west of you through the Coolong Valley. Hey, oh, 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 find out, Idiot! Rescue team Alpha, rescue command. What's the registration of Simon Presswich's car? Rescue command, Sierra. Tango Uniform 6441. I'm watching it drive away from me east on the Evans Fire Trail in sector 439, over. Copy that. I'll have police move to intercept it. Good patrol. I'll see you there. I'm at 32.244.7, confirmed. The car has hit a tree. Over. Hello? Rescue Team Bravo, we're at 32.447.9, moving east, so we're half an hour away at least. Over. Rescue Command, I've got ambulances and police on standby. They can be with you in 10. Standby, I'll let you know. Can you hear me? Simon, Simon Prestwich. Hey. Hey! Hey! Rescue two portable to rescue command. Michelle, the driver's a teenage girl. What about Fred? No sign of him. He's not in the car. Right, get a name. Rescue command to all units. Did you copy that? The driver of the vehicle is not Presswitch. Continue search. Yeah, rescue team, bravo, copy that. What's she doing in his car? 30 mm, something prospector, teenage girl. Hate to think. Pulse is fast, BP slightly raised, but it looks like you're in one piece. So you want to tell us your name? Hey, it's okay. I just want to make sure you're not hurt. It's, it, it's okay, it's okay, just calm down. Shock. Are you in any pain? Well, uh, judging by the way you bolted from that car, I'd say you're doing just fine. You're a lucky girl. Just crashed a car, how's that lucky? Uh, we can speak. I'm not going to hospital. Why do you want to at least tell us your name? <sighs> Brittany. There we go. And can I have a surname, Brittany? Spears. Brittany Spears. <laughs> <laughs> Dwyer, okay, Brittany Dwyer. How old are you, Brittany? 16. Brittany, do you know where Simon is? The guy who owns that car. Do you know who he is? No, Vanessa, I did not agree. When she said, you said she could have a car, this is the noise I made. Oh, shit. No, 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 that's not the noise I made. This is the noise I made. Are you ready? Uh-huh. Right? How does that sound like a yes? I don't care if she wants a Honda. She's going to get a nice 
blocky, sensible Volvo. And you can tell her that. Well, if, she, if you didn't agree with everything she said... Hello? Hello? Uh, sit rep. Uh, critical. Rescue base to rescue command. Rescue command. We're tied up. This truck is smoking like a chimney. What? It was serviced three weeks ago. Apparently not. I reckon it's your rings. About a two hour fix, Max? We'll be rolling in an hour. No, don't call anyone. I can do it. Yeah. No, mate, I'm serious. You're going to spend $2,000 replacing a 20 buck oil ring. Hello, McLean Diesel Service. Vince, if I can't fix this, I'll give you two grand. You there, mate? Hello? One hour. I'll get the oil. Done. What did you say to this woman? Done. Simon! So what was the big deal about the ropes before? Oh, look, I'm just sick of you setting the agenda, you know? We always pick your DVD, we eat what you want to eat, stay at your mum's house. Fine. We'll stay at your house. Eat a salad. Snuggle. Oh, awesome. I love snuggling. Simon! You know, maybe we're spending too much time together. Well, what does that mean? Well, we're always arguing. Oh, no, we're not. Yes, we are. Look what we're doing now. It's not all the time. You're the one who brought up the rope bags. You're trying to create arguments. I'm not trying to create anything. I hate arguing. OK, well, don't. Simon! Don't screw the crew. Yeah, thanks. Yeah, the local cops know her. The Dwyers have a farm about five k's away. Yeah, right. SES door knocked her yesterday. Some officers going to meet you there to uh, get a statement. Great, thanks, Vince. Did she say why she was driving Presswitch's car? Ah, still doing the moody teen thing. <laughs> yeah, know that one well. All right, I'll see you out there. Rescue boat's out. I told you I didn't steal it. It's all right, it's OK. Let's just get you in the patrol. Listen, Brittany, the man's car that you were driving, there's a lot of people out here looking for him. He's lost. He could be in trouble. Yeah, well, it's not my fault he left the car with the keys in it. You're not in trouble, OK? Where were you going? Away. Away where? <sighs> OK, that's it. All right, Brittany, we're going to have to take you home. No. No, I'm not going back there. Why? I'm just not OK. I can never go back there again. Well, then we have to take you to a police station. Listen, the cops are going to want to talk to you. Either at home or at the police station. Which is it going to be? This is bullshit. You stole a car. We have to take you to someone, OK? So it's your parents or the police station you choose. Fine. Home. I'm never having kids. <laughs> no. How's it travelling? Yes, I know. The way his eyebrows knit together when he frowns. No, thank you. Look, I couldn't imagine being married to the guy. Yeah, I am single. But look, he loves you guys and he's going to come around. No, I'm just glad I could help. All right, Ness. Bye. Ness? Why are you talking to my wife? My very ex-wife? Doing you another favour, Vince. Do me a favour and fix this truck. Done. Yeah, done like a dog's dinner. Clock's ticking, Lockie. Shit. OK, once you drop her off, get back and resume the search. There's something going on with her. How's that? Domestic problems, maybe. I think she was running away from home. Well, she wouldn't be the first teenager to do that. Let the police handle it, Lara. Our focus is press switch. Got to go. You're in charge? I am coordinating the search, yes. Where's Simon's? Simon was married to our daughter. Where are the children? What children? What's he done to them? Simon hasn't been the same since our daughter died. We're worried he could do something. Right, OK, come sit down over here. I need you to start from the beginning, all right? Tell me everything you know. Dude, if it's not working, you should save yourselves the trouble and just break up. Well, we're happy sometimes. Simon! 
can't just dump her. Yeah, you want her to break up with you. At least it wouldn't be my fault. Simon! Tell you what you do, double down. Simon! Seriously, if you don't know what to do with a chick, you double down. You up the ante in the relationship stakes, then, you know, it's her turn. Either she breaks up with you, mm. great, or else you've moved the relationship onto the next level. Yeah, let me guess where you read this, the internet? No. Doctor's waiting room. Have you even told her you loved her yet? Double down. Rescue command to all units. Uh, rescue team Bravo, go ahead. Rescue team Alpha, go ahead. We think Simon Presswich has his two boys with him, oh, Oliver and Declan. Aged eight and five. He may present a danger to them. His wife died recently and his in-laws believe that he's depressed, suicidal. Please tell me it works. Let's go. Nice. Ready? Rescue Team Alpha, you need to find out where that girl got the car from. Stop messing around. Did you hear that, Brittany? Kids' lives are in danger. We need your help. Please tell us, Brittany. Rescue Command to Rescue Team Bravo. I need you to move approximately to 54.6. 34.9. That's where the girl said she found Presswitch's vehicle. And then she say if she saw anyone there? Just get there and tell me what you find. Okay? Rescue Team Alpha. Once you drop the girl off, I need you to get back over to Rescue Team Bravo's coordinates. Copy that, Michelle. Rescue Team Alpha out. What happened to your arm? Nothing. What are you afraid of? Help! Help! This way! This way! Is that your mum? This way! Coming. Thank goodness, it's my husband. I, I couldn't leave him, he's hurt bad. Is he conscious? Don't think so. We're gonna have to get in there somehow. Sir, can you hear me? How long's he been like this? A half hour, more. I, I, I cleared some of the debris off him and, and, and tied off the biggest cut with my jacket, but he, he's still bleeding. All right, Lara, we'll have to secure all this before we can get to him. Team Alpha to Rescue Command. I've got a patient trapped beneath a tractor at the Dwyer property. We got backup? No, the others are nearly at Presswitch's camp. No, darling, that's gonna be okay. Just talk to me. She knew about this the whole time. Yeah. You've not done anything wrong. Her dad could have died. Let's make sure he doesn't. It's gonna be okay. This is near where the girl found the car. So it is. Nice place for a family picnic. Hello? Anyone here? Hello? Oh, smell that? <coughs> oh. You wanna check in there? <coughs> oh. Heidi? Oh. Ah. That? <laughs> oh. Rescue Team Bravo to Rescue Command. We found the tent. There's no sign of press which all the kids. Oh. Rescue Team Alpha to Rescue Command. Can we get some help down here now, please? Yes, Rescue Command. Copy you, Dean. Rescue 3. What's your ETA? We're at least 20 minutes off. If this thing breaks down... Uh, she'll make it. Oh, great. The X. Again. Well, answer it. Be nice. I'm busy. Rescue Team Bravo, keep searching. Your priority is the children. Copy that, Michelle. Rescue Team Alpha, 
I'm sorry, Dean, I can't recall the others. There's a, an ambulance is en route. Let's get command out. Looks like we're going to have to improvise. Yeah. The flowers I sent you. Uh, well, they're your favourites, right? <laughs> the, the Capitaine. Uh, yeah, I'm looking forward to it too, hon. Yeah, me too. See you there. Bye. <laughs> yeah, well, apparently I've booked us a table at Le Capitaine. Nice. Do you know how much that place costs? We are, I think she's worth it, Vince. We're divorced! What kind of help is that? Mate, it's army training. We win hearts and minds. What can I say? Stay off my phone. You're welcome. Simon! Oliver! Declan! Heidi. What? Um... What? Maybe we should move in together. <laughs> you serious? Yeah, 100%. Simon! Oh, that's a big step, Jordan. Oh, well, if you don't want to commit... No, it's just... I mean, you were saying that we're spending too much time together and now you want to spend it all together. It's... Surprise. Well, you know me, king of surprises. Well, I have to think about it. But it's a nice surprise. Mr. Dwyer, you've had an accident. Can you take a deep breath for me? <sighs> this tractor rolled on top of you. Do you remember how that happened? Yeah. What's his condition? He's got a fractured femur and a decent laceration in his left arm. You've got to get this off him fast. Yeah, we're almost good to go. How's Brittany? <sighs> She's giving her mum a hard time. Brittany's here. She came back. Yeah, she had a car accident, but she's OK. We brought her home. Do you remember how this happened? No. I don't remember anything. Are you sure? Just get me out of here. Pop this mask in your case. How's Henry? He's stable. He'll be out soon. How'd it happen? It was an accident. It was my fault. I was driving the tractor and lost control. Was Brittany here? Yeah. Yeah, yeah. She, she was going for help. Won't you, love? Uh, she was going for help. Good to go. Something's not right here. Can yeah, we get a path from a tractor through a wall? Are you serious? All right, we're about to start lifting, Mr. Dwyer. What are the police doing here? This was an accident. Oh, they're taking a statement. From who? Your wife and Brittany. What's Brittany got to do with anything? She was in a car accident. So you can't remember what happened? What did Renata say? She said that you, uh, you forgot to put the handbrake on and the tractor just rolled onto you. Yeah, that's it. Lara, you wanna give me a hand with the spine board? She didn't say that. This was not an accident. Okay, Lara, this is not our problem, all right? Leave it to the cops. Simon! Simon! This stupid double down, what if she does wanna move in? You love her, don't you? Yeah, well, she's great, but... Jordan! I was thinking about what you said. If you really want to do it, then let's do it. Let's, let's move in together. Cool. <laughs> uh, where should we buy? What? You didn't say anything about buying a house. Rent money's dead money. Simon! Over! BP and pulse is stable laceration to the left arm and upper leg query fracture to the hip. Look, he'll be in plaster for a good few weeks, but he'll pull through. It's great news. Isn't it, Brittany? Oh, thanks. Let's get you inside, love. Rescue team Alpha to rescue command. We're done here. Father's on the way to Bathurst Hospital. Over. What about the girl? I've asked for child services to come and check out the family situation. Why? The parents were lying about the accident. Okay, get over to 
39.8. Search the grid and let me know if the command out. What? Keys. Sure, I left them in the ignition. Check the glove box. I'm not. Here, use mine. Brittany. What is with this girl? She obviously doesn't want us to leave. What does she expect us to do? Help her? Well, the cops were just here. Why didn't she say something then? Well, maybe she was scared. Of what? <coughs> Brittany! <sighs> I'll find a check inside. Be careful. Brittany. Oh, oh, oh. Stop her. Rescue one portable to rescue command. I'm in pursuit of Brittany Dwyer. Over. No. She stabbed her mother. This is now a matter for the police. Michelle, this girl's in a state. She hasn't got any injuries. You'll get them stumbling around out here. OK, well, you pursue with absolute caution, Dean. You want to get some more searches out here? No, I'm stretched as it is. I'm sure this girl can't be out here at night time. Neither can the kids. Stand by. Vincent Lockyer here. You owe me two grand. Hey, you got us here. How's it going to get us back? I've got dinner reservations. Rescue 2 Portable, what is your situation? I've slowed her bleeding, but her BP's still dropping. I need assistance here immediately. Out. It's not her fault. She's scared. I'd be scared too if my mum kept me tied up. It's for her own sake. She's trying to harm herself. She's sick. What do you mean, sick? <laughs> Not right. <sighs> Rescue 2 portable to all units. Brittany Dwyer may be suffering from some sort of psychotic episode. Her mother thinks she might try to hurt herself. Right, get out there. Take the patrol. I want one of you with Lara, the other one with Dean. Yeah? Go. Show any back up right now. We're gonna find this girl. No! You can't abandon our grandkids for some teenage brat. Please, sir, just, just keep it calm. Oh, right? How can we, we keep no. calm when Simon's out there with We them. don't know that he means to harm them, right? So we've just got to calm down. Rescue team Bravo to rescue command. Michelle, we found blood. There's more over here. There's some down here. Blood trailers moving due east. We're at 58.9, 34.5. Rescue command to rescue team Bravo. Jordan, stay on that trail. Move it. Let's go. You're going to be OK, Miss Dwyer. Have they found Brittany? Not yet. This wasn't her fault. She just started having these... Try not to move for me. ...violent outbursts. That's herself. Talks about strange things. We don't know what's going on. You haven't taken her to a doctor? Henry never believed in mental illness. This is teenage blues. She needs help. The last few days, the paranoia and voices got so bad. I mean, you would have to do something. We were taking her to the hospital this morning. That's why she ran over her dad. She's scared. Renata, stay with me. She's just a girl. My beautiful girl. Good night, Renata. Renata, come back. Renata, stay with me. Rescue 2 Portable, my patient's crashing. I need assistance immediately. Rescue Command to Rescue 2 Portable. Vince should be with you any second, Lara. What do you need? Need more Hartmans. Where's Lockie? I'm going to help Dean. Brittany! Brittany! 
Rescue 6 portable to Rescue 1 portable. I'm heading west from the farmhouse. How far off are you, bro? Dean, do you copy? Where are you? Brittany, come on! I'm on your side! Mate. That's your radio, Dean. She's coming round. Come on, Renata. Okay. That's it, Renata. Come back to us. That's the way. Squeeze my hand. Good. Rescue 7 portable to Rescue Command. Where's our ambulance? Rescue Command, five minutes off. That's your patient. Stabilised. Any news on Dean? That blood? Two days out here with that kind of blood loss. Hopefully it's not the kids. <sighs> Simon! Rescue 6 portable to Rescue Command. I can't raise Dean. Rescue Command, copy that. Keep trying to reach him. Get back to his last known position, which is approximately 34.951.4 out. Rescue Team Bravo to Rescue 6 portable. Have we lost Dean? Rescue 6 portable, it looks like it. What is it with this Bermuda Triangle bit of bush? Everyone just bloody disappears. Silent. Silent press switch. Where's Brittany? We're still looking for her. It's my fault. If something were to happen to her, we'll find her. I should have got her help months ago. Please, please help her. We will. That kid's been crook for months and they only call the hospital now. They didn't know how to handle it. Rescue 6 portable to Rescue Command. We've handballed the patient to the Ambos. Any sign of Dina? That is a negative, Vince. I'm really worried. It's not like him to go up here like this. Yeah, there's got to be some logical reason. We'll search the surrounding area. Out. OK. Stay with me, mate. Just stay with me. I'm Dina from Rescue. You Simon Presswich? Boys. You find my boys? OK, let's just get you right first, OK? I'm just going to get some fluids in here. Right, eh? We haven't found them yet. My fault. Going forward or I fell. Smack my head in down here. Okay, don't worry about it, mate. Okay, don't worry about that. Hey, Simon, stay with me. Stay with me, Simon. Hey, hey. Help! Help! Brittany, hey, hey, Brittany, Brittany, please. Brittany, please, I need your help, okay? This man is very, very sick. He could die now. Please, just come over here. You're trying to trap me. Oh, come on, Brittany. Does this look like a trap to you? Huh? Now, please, come over here and help. You hurt? Is that the man everyone's looking for? Yeah. So when, when the yes, yes came to my house yesterday, it wasn't all made up. They, they weren't just coming for me. No, this is not made up. This is all very real, Brittany. Now, please, come over here. I told them I'm not crazy. Okay, right now, Brittany, this is not about you, okay? I would never think you're crazy. Now, please, come over here. You're real hard, us, aren't you? I don't need to be. Glad I'm not your kid. Glad I'm not your parent. Would you hold this? I didn't want to hurt them. They were going to have me locked up. That's OK. Now, please, just squeeze this nice and gentle for me, OK? Why? Well, he's lost a lot of blood. Right now, his heart's working really hard to keep moving oxygen around his body. Can we get that fluid in him? OK, 
get your blood pressure back up. So will you do it? For him? Okay. Thank you. You're welcome. Jane! Simon! Jordan, what's going on? We I mean, moving in together, buying houses? You haven't even told me you love me. A rescue four portable to rescue six portable. Lockie, any sign of him? Rescue six portable, none, mate. Yeah, everyone's saying that they love each other. It doesn't really help relationships. Oh, what buying houses does? I mean, don't you think we should get married first? Are you serious? Are you? You better not be trying to double down on me, Jordan. Because that'd be childish. Hey, guys, over here. Hey, stop! Hey! Ah, well done. You found me. Now keep up. Okay. You're doing great, alright? Just keep going. Keep squeezing nice and gentle. Alright, Simon, I've given you some morphine, but, uh, well, this is still gonna hurt. Okay. Brittany, I'm going to need you to hold him for me. <laughs> hey, you can do this. You can. Yeah. Let's put this down on his chest. Give me your hands. Okay, put them just here. All right, push down. That's the way. Like this? Nice and tight. Okay. Oh! Okay, all right. That's it. Is he dead? No, no, he's just... Passed out, it's okay. Worst of it's over. Not bad. For a crazy girl? You're a bit sick. But it's manageable. Yeah, with zombie pills. I want to be normal. Can I just be normal? Normal's overrated. get through this. You think? I've had voices before. I can usually tell them to piss off. But lately, out there in the bush, like ghosts always crying and calling out. What do they say? Just kid stuff. Dad won't let me talk about him, says it gives them power over me. Dean! Dino! Hey, over here! This is a trap! This is not a trap. This is not a trap, okay? Let me calm go. down. You lied. I did not lie to you, okay? Now, calm down. These, they're here. They're here to help this man, okay? Please, calm down. Simon Presswich, fractured ribs, compound tib fib fracture, laceration to the torso, severely dehydrated, and possible internal bleed. He's had two bags of Hartmann's. How much you're on your radio next time? It went MIA, smart ass. Rescue 5 Portable to Rescue Command. We found Dean with Presswitch. He's alive. Brittany's here as well. This is Rescue Command. Is she OK? She's good. She's fine. Rescue Command, what about the kids? They're not here. Right, get him out of there and get back to your search grids ASAP. Those kids are not going to survive another night out there. Simon Presswitch, 35. Raise up. Decrease LOC. All obs are stable, but he has a compound fracture to his right tibia and a possible infection. Put the foot down, get him to the hospital, guys. We've got to get back to the kids. Well, we're moving the teams in the new positions based on where you found Presswitch. Where are they? Simon! Hey, where just, are the boys? We're just going to let them do their job. Simon, where are our boys? I can't hear you. What's he done to them? He's done nothing. He went and searched for water, fell down a cliff and lost consciousness. They probably just went looking for him. He didn't harm them. No, he didn't. We'll be okay, we'll find them. How are you? You okay? No. I'm not going to hospital. Brittany, you have to go. Dean, please don't Brittany, let them. Brittany, don't Dean, please. It's okay. Dean. Brittany, just take it easy, all right? Dean, please don't let them. Brittany, you need help. They can't make okay, me. Just give me a second, okay? Just back off, all right? Yeah, just so you'll have your chance with her in a second. Thanks. Brittany, what are you afraid of? Tell me. Oh, I don't know, maybe being 
put in a straight jacket and plugged into a power socket? You watch too many horror films. I'll give you some meds and they'll send you home. Will it stop the voices? Yeah. Brittany, you said the voices were out there. Talking kid stuff, yeah? What sort of kid stuff? Like crying, calling out, I don't know. But you said these voices were different. When did you first hear them? Kids. Mm, only a couple of days ago. Were they boys' voices? How did you know? Okay, where did you hear them? This is another trap, man. You sound hey, crazy. No, 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 this is not another trap, okay? I want you to show me where they are. Dean, we're going to get back to just, first. just give me a minute. Will you show me? Just you. Just me. Come on. Come away in the car. What are you doing? I think she might know where the Presswich kids are. She's been describing voices in the bush. That Boys' could voices. Be the illness talk. That or she's playing it at a runner. Yeah, maybe, but right now that's all we got. Okay, it's your call. You know better than anyone else. Where you heard them? All around here. Okay. Can you hear them now? Come on. Come on, it's okay. It's okay. Oliver! Declan! You sure this is the place? Yes. You said, you said ghosts. Sounded like. Hey. Anything? Nothing yet. You had me followed. I said just you. Brittany, I didn't know. You lied again. No, I'm not going back. You asked me and I told you this is where I heard them. Brittany, they're our friends, okay? Yeah. They're not going to do... Shh. I heard something. Over there. Come on. Come on, come on, come on. Guys, are you okay? Kaplan sick. It's a spider bite. When did that happen, honey? It was last night. Let's get you out of here. Rescue Portable 6 to Rescue Command. We're gonna need spider antivenin ready to go immediately. Right. Come with us now, okay? It's gonna be all right, okay? Just trust us. No. It's gonna be okay. And what are you it's okay. Dean, talk to them. It's... The voices are real. You heard them too. Doesn't that make you crazy? I've got, I've got it. I've got it. I've got it. I've got it. It's okay. Brittany. Brittany, you're not crazy, all right? But what? She did attack your parents. I thought you were on my side. Hey, hey, we are on your side, okay? We want you to get better. Now, isn't that what you want? Huh? Yeah. 
All right. So get in the bloody ambulance. Hot us. Hey. Some company? Say, so alright? Dude, she wants me to propose to her. Oh, so she doubled down on you. Well played, Heidi. I've got to do it. Why? It's what she wants, I think. <laughs> Is it what you want? I think this morning you're going to break up. Go on, piss off. Hey, Heidi. Hey. I wanted to ask you something. What? Will you... I can't do this. I, I can't say it. I, I don't know what's wrong with me. I can say it. You can? Yeah. You want to break up? What? I, I thought we were going to move in together. I know, you were just testing me, Jordan. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I was. I guess it's just not really working, eh? No, I guess, I guess it's not. But, you know, we can still be friends. With benefits? Oh, you wish. Maybe just tonight. What's going on there? Ah, my work here is done. What about your reports? Oh, damn idiot. <laughs> Let's go. <laughs> Save the moment, bro. We're getting married. <laughs> Watch it. Already? Yeah, they're flat to yourself. Your mail's forming drifts in my hallway. Not bad. Where's bachelor number two? <laughs> Stupid hey. instructions. Furniture, new apartment. Anyone think you're settling down, Lockie? No, it's sad, hey? Ikea lady thought me and Chase were a couple. Ah, Chase, you can do better. So, Dino, you've uh, stepped up. Who can? Take it easy, Tiger. It's a morning run. Right. Just keep up. Let's go. Uh, this is gonna suck. Come on, boys, you ready? Left, right, left, right, left, right, left, right. <laughs> I don't know, Private Gallagher. Private? Who made you captain? You old blokes need to pace yourselves. Sorry, we can't hear you. All the way back there, Chasey. First one to the point. Captain Chase Gallagher, sounds pretty good, doesn't it? Oh! Ah, uh, guys? Guys? Fourth floor. It's the third apartment along. Yeah. Rescue. I got it. Hello, rescue. We need access to your apartment. I'll try the next one. Oh, I got this. Are you gonna tell me you learned this in the SAS? No. Breaking into your room as a kid. Don't move. Where was rescue? We're gonna get you down. What's your name? Kim. Okay, Kim, stay still. We're coming. Hey, wait, 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 wait. I'm gonna get something to secure you and Kim. Ah! It's okay. It's okay. Oh. Sorry, buddy. Can I borrow this? Uh, sorry, I'll call you back. Uh, Vince? Yeah, we've got a situation. A kite surfer has been blown onto a building. Don't have to get yourself killed, huh? Almost getting you stabbing you around. Ah. Progress. 
Stay still. Can you bring her in? There we go. Nah, the kite rope's are snagged. Uh, well, there yeah, they've got her stabilised for now, but I don't know how long Lockie can hold her. Bloody kite surfing. Mickey Mouse sport if ever I saw one. What's wrong with just grabbing a board and catching a wave? Uh, I'll ask her when she comes down. Good, you do that. Uh, I'll go to the roof and secure the kite tail. No, you won't. Wait for backup. Uh, rescue one's around the corner. Keep me posted. I'm going to bring you in nice and tight. I'm Lockie. How you doing? <laughs> I'm better. Yeah. You right? Good. Sit rep, Chase. Uh, no fractures or lacerations from what I can tell, but that shoot's hanging by a thread. All right, let's set up an anchor point on the roof and bring her down. I'll go make Dean and Lockie safe. Dean signed up to one of Lockie's boot camps. Yeah. Massacres. Friggin' hard ass. And the rest. Hard ass, hard abs, hard biceps. Michelle, how's the Inquisition? We still in business? Don't joke. Douglas is talking budget cuts. He's going to axe one of the units. Well, surely not ours. We've got the best record in the state. Oh, does Steph know his mum are in striking distance? Hey, listen, Vince, I need that yellow folder with our response times in it. Have one of the boys run it over when they get in, yeah? Uh, the Gallaghers are on a job. I thought they had the morning off. Yeah, they, they did. They found a kite surfer hanging off the side of an apartment block. Well, they just jumped in without any proper gear or backup. Yeah, well, apparently she's cute. So, yeah, listen to me. Well, it's beyond the call of duty, Michelle. The commissioner will love it. Oh, not if she falls to her death. Just get me that folder, Vince. I don't. The Turner. Stefano. You got her? Please get me off. <laughs> we're just waiting for rescue, Kim. I thought you were rescued. Well, we're off duty. We were until we saw you. <laughs> How is she? Well, like you'd expect. One minute she's catching Eric away, the next she's stuck up there. Oh. Kim! Lara, we're on the roof. We'll let you know when we have the kite ring secured. <laughs> right? Grab her, grab her. Kim, this is Lara. Hey, Kim, we're going to secure you, all right? Okay. Just Hold hurry. On. Hold on. Uh. Loosen it off, Dana? Yep. You're doing good. Uh. I'll get gotcha. you. I'll get gotcha. you. You okay? Kim. Yep. Good. <laughs> a little better now. So, you still looking for somewhere to live? We need a flatmate. A flatmate or flat screen? Oh, if you want to bring the 40 inch, you know, I'm sure we could find somewhere to put it. It's a 50 inch and it's me mum's. Besides, this place isn't for me. Too many tosses. Well, what's one more? I've got a friend who's looking for a place. I'll give yeah. you his number. His number? What? He's a friend. Hey, we split up. You can date whoever you want. Oh, thank you. I'm not dating anyone. Why are you? Uh, what self respecting woman would date someone who still lives with their mum? She did. Rescue base to rescue two portable. Sit rep, Lara. Rescue two portable. The patient's name is Kim Whiteley Vince. We're securing her now. We should have her free in a few minutes. We'll get a move on. There's a heavy onshore breeze coming your way. Could blow her off the building. Yeah, copy that. Dan. Perfect kite surfing conditions. You're going to end up blowing to the harbour if you're not careful. Where's the fun in being careful? So, uh, you're into extreme sports, Kimbo? Not just sports. You? Ah, uh, well. Let's just say I wouldn't be much use to rescue if I couldn't handle heights. He's churning it. Oh, he's a Gallagher, isn't he? <laughs> rescue must be a pretty cool job. Oh, uh, yeah. Life's an adventure. Living life on the edge. It's pretty cool. Yeah, really on the edge. Last week we spent the whole day oiling tools. Really Indiana Jones stuff. <sighs> I got her. How you going? I'm Jordan. I'm going to strap this on, get you out of here. You can take me anywhere. Do you reckon you could get any closer to her? I should cut him loose. Yeah, so like I was saying, we had this rescue last week. Underwater rescue, about four to five minutes. Is meters. that right? So you came down that road pretty quick. Yeah, uh, I don't know. Just practice. How do you keep your nerve? I don't know. Just don't think about it, really. Yeah, it's actually perfectly safe. It's fine. OK. So there's some justice in the world. Come in. Gallagher, your time's up. Come on, Lockie. That's the way. Easy does it. <laughs> when your uh, ego's recovered, head downstairs and help Jordan with a patient. Lockie, 
That's the one. How'd you know? Ah, you were at the Baby Hotel Thursday night. Enid, yeah? We haven't met, but uh, I know all about you. Oh, well, that's lucky for you. I didn't catch your name. Your mates in WA told us everything, Gallagher. How long did you reckon you could keep it a secret? Well, if this is about killing that swan, I told them it shouldn't have been on the go-kart track in the first We're place. Enough I... bullshit. Let's go. Oh, I'm going to say my place or yours first. Whoa, 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 whoa. Oh. Chase, are you seeing this? Uh, rescue four portable to all units. We've got a situation on the beach. Lockie's just been grabbed by someone. Uh, you right with this? Yeah, go, go. Seriously, fellas, I'm in the middle of a rescue. Move it, Gallagher. Uh, rescue base. Chase, repeat that. A woman and some guys in suits are dragging Lockie into their car. What kind of suits? I don't know. Cops, gangsters, suits. Well, get down there and stop them. Dino, can you confirm? Dean, do you copy? Get off me! Hey! Hey, what do you think you're doing? Back off! Back off! Gallagher! Lockie! 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 What happened? Lockie happened. Come on. Rescue 3 portable, almost there, Lara. And I thought kite surfing was a rush. It's not always like this. Rescue 3 portable to Rescue 5 portable, she's free. What about you, Jordan? Can you still breathe? Girlfriend? Her, uh, yeah. Uh, I mean, no. Uh, ex. You sure? Sure, I'm sure. Ancient history. Thank you, Mr. DeStefano. Excellent work as always. Station manager, Latorno, Sydney. What do you mean they just dragged him off? Is it an arrest or a kidnapping? We're trying to find out. The local cops are Mr. on their Torno, way. Mr. the floor is yours. Bastards. Excuse me? Oh, I'm sorry, not you, sir. Um, uh, I've got to go, Vince. May I be excused, sir? I have an unfolding situation involving one of my crew. Another one. This is not a good time, Latorno. This is your chance to present your case to the group. Any decisions made in your absence could have serious consequences for your unit. My unit's response times speak for themselves. I'm sorry. You may well be. You're excused. Okay! You know this chick? Never seen him before. But does he have any enemies? Can't chase, it's Lockie. Oh, that's a stupid question. Uh, rescue 4 portable to rescue base. We've found the car. It's a black Holden Caprice. Zulu Bravo Alpha 267. They're federal plate. Feds? Shit. Well, what does that mean? It means Lockie's pissed off someone important. Rescue 2 portable to rescue 1 portable. Dean, any sign of Lockie? There. They're heading over the rock. Stay where you are. The cops are on their way. Tell them to catch up. Dino, you don't know what you're walking into here. Chase, stop him. Where'd they go? I don't know, but if they're spooks, we might want well to start looking under rocks. Hey, Lucky! Right, Chase, he's not getting in that car until we know where these clowns are. Stop, Gallagher, you've got nowhere to go! Lucky! Lucky! Sorry. Get down there and see where it comes hey, whoa, whoa, out. Whoa, 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 stop, stop. Move, okay. you're in the way. That's the whole point. Now, you secret girls want to tell us what you're doing? Gathering nuts. Now move. Uh, who are you? Major Claire Newell, Australian Defence Force investigator. Now move or I will have you arrested. Chase, they're here now. I'll send them to you. Hey. I don't know what's happening, but they're up at the point. Major and you'll say what she wanted with Lockie? Uh, apparently, it's classified. Oh, that'll go down well with Dean. Let's get up there. Yeah, they've got to check you out. <sighs> Can't you do that? No, they've got to give you x-rays, but I'm sure you'll be OK. Thanks to you. It's a team effort. Oh, come on. Anyone can haul on a rope, but you stepped over the edge for me. True. 
the blanket. So, um, <clears throat> do you have a number? Come on, Jordan. Step over the edge. Hey! Zakowski! Excuse me. Little help? I can't believe you hit on a concussed patient. Are you serious? That's not classy. Who says she's concussed? Oh, come on, she's all over you. I knew it once. Guess you had a head injury too, eh? Yeah, that would explain it. You too. Whatever you think Lockie's done, you're wrong, okay? He's our brother, we know him. Oh, he's told you all about his tours of duty, has he? What he get up to in Afghanistan? You yeah, didn't think so. Major you. What kind of stunt are you pulling dragging one of my crew off in the middle of a rescue? Michelle Latorno, right? Yeah. I got a right to know what you want with my employee. No, you don't. And if you impede my investigation, I'll have you charged with treason under the Internal Security Act. That's bullshit. Vince Marcello, 51, divorced, twice, lives alone, loves the dogs, surfing, gold membership at the Ambassador Club. Didn't know you had a law degree as well. It's a platinum membership. This is harassment. No, it's an investigation. I also know that you're standing up Commissioner Douglas at the moment. Don't give me a reason to call him. Ma'am. He's gone. Well, he's got to show up somewhere. Listen, any one of you sees him, you call me. I know he's your brother, but he's no saint. Trust me. We are not the bad guys here. You play the part pretty well. Well, I admire your loyalty. Pity it doesn't run in the family. Oh, and what's that supposed to mean, huh? Where's your brother? Tell them they need a warrant. Yeah, they've got one. Well, if they give you any more trouble, let me know. I've got rescue legal team chomping at the bit. All right, will do. Bye. Oi, what are you looking for? Your brother. He's not going to be hiding in the toaster, is he? Are you right? He's vanished. Yeah, well, he's SAS. He's trained to live in caves and eat seaweed. Look, I'm going to grab my staff, head to the old man, see if he's holed up there. I'm guessing this isn't going to make it into your presentation tomorrow. Who knows what I missed? Stefano's probably passed a motion to shut us down. You know, I, uh, I see your mate De Stefano down at the Ambassador Club a fair bit. Oh, yeah? Yeah, he's got a weakness for old single malt. Gets very chatty when he's had a few. Is that right? Hmm. This only goes to a select few. Platinum card, access all areas. <laughs> Lovely. Thank you, Vince. Nothing? He'll turn up. Yeah, five years from now, like nothing ever happened. Are you kidding me? Stalker alert! Hey, how'd you pull up? A few bruised ribs and uh, no concussion. No concussion? That's good. What are you doing here? We got cut off before. You were about to give me your number. I was? <sighs> yeah, well, I can't. Uh, it's against the rules. Whose rules? Hers? No, rescues. Can't fraternise with the patients outside of rescue. It's a shame. We could have had some fun fraternising. Why are you looking so smug? I don't look smug. You should have got a number. What? Carp EDM, Jordan, sees it, eh? You're a free agent. Carp of what? Now you tell me. Why'd you do that? <sighs> I don't know. I mean, I want him to be happy, but she's so... It's weird. You know what I mean? Sure. That's Dad's place, Jim, Alan's Chinese palace. I mean, does he hang around anywhere else? Oh, five in the morning, don't ask me. Uh, do you want dinner or breakfast? Either way, it's noodles. What about his stuff, Chase? I mean, is he having a uh, dress book or anything? I already looked. I know what's in that box there. Eh? 
kind of hard to believe a 29-year-old bloke and this is the extent of his worldly possessions. Yeah, well, he moved around a lot. Yeah, running from one spot fight to the next. What did he do? He punched out his commanding officer, didn't he? That's why they discharged him. Yeah, but there's got to be more to it than that. You reckon he killed someone? Chase, I don't think the SAS were in Afghanistan shopping for carpets. You know what's sad? That he's in real shit and he still doesn't come to us for help. Lucky? Lucky! Not this time. Step aside, boys. Eighteen months ago, I was on recon with my unit. We started copying some seriously heavy fire. We called in air support, but it didn't come. Absolute shit fight, so we retreated. My mate Jake, he died, and two more wounded. And? The powers that be are saying we did get the air support. They're saying we lost our nerve and our CO accused us of cowardice. So it's your word against the army? Sounds like a typical lucky fight. Not just my word. I recorded the entire thing on my head cam and kept it. Now the brass wants to bury it. Well, where is it? I lock up in Lane Cove. The key's in my work locker. Why didn't you do something with it before this? Like put it on WikiLeaks or something? Well, if you had dirt on rescue, Chase, what would you do? I was just trying to do my job. I wasn't looking for some smoking gun. The army's been like family, boys. What would your mate Jacob wanted you to do? Well, he wouldn't want to be remembered as a coward, I can tell you that. He'd want me to march right up to the army officers, come clean and stuff the consequences. It's your call. If you want to run, we won't judge you. But if you stay and fight, we've got your back. So what's it going to be, Lucky? Rescue base to rescue one. Rescue one. We got a call out to Ocean Drive, Freshwater Beach. Some idiot stuck on a cliff, over. It'd be quicker if Dean went straight from the station. It would be if he's here. Right now I'm down three Gallagher's. Lights and bells. Lara, rescue base out. Copy that. Anyway, Jordan, I did you a favour. She wasn't your type. I'm looking out for you. Maybe she's out of my league anyway. What? What does that make me? Bargain basement? Guys, enough. I feel like I'm in the twilight zone. Just make a decision, OK? You're either together or you're not. 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 So what's on this memory stick? Some drunken general? Some officer making it past his subordinate? My orders are retrieve the footage, not comment on it. Right, so you can't tell me whether or not Lockie's done anything illegal. I can tell you he attacked his CO. I can tell you he ran from the field of battle. He's a coward at best. Not for Lockie, I know. Leave her alone, Major. Gallagher, Settle down, guys. Back. Take it easy. He's not going to run. Huh? You want me? You got me. You know what I want. Oh, yeah. Another pip on your shoulder. Lockie, this is the rescue lawyer. Don't say anything until she gets here. Can we have a moment in private, please? Wait for the lawyer, Lockie. Off the record? Sure. Army doesn't like cowards, Lockie. It especially doesn't like cowards who sell out their mates. Rescue, huh? So what is it you do here? You pull cats out of trees, you help old ladies out of the shower, that sort of thing? Yeah, on a tough day. It's got to be a step down. I suppose for a desk jockey like yourself, it might seem that way. East Timor. 
Schön. Wo bist du Come on, Lockie. You're Army. You're always going to be Army. Yeah. Got a discharge paper that says differently. And what if I can make that go away? You give us the footage, authorization to readmit you into the SAS, pending a psych and physical assessment. You see, if it were up to me, you would be in a dark hole somewhere. Oh, cheers. But uh, I guess someone up there likes you. No. Somebody up there wants to shut me up. Think about it. You start over, record swept clean. Serious. I can start over. She's stuck about halfway down. Righto. Jordan set the anchors and help Heidi with the gear. There you go, mate. Thank you, Officer Wilson. I'll take it back. I liked it better when you were arguing. You blokes can forget about looking in that truck. I just had it detailed. I don't care. Show us. Come on. Our orders are to search this entire station. All right. Now move it. <sighs> too late, too late. Put it away, put it away. Lockie, what's going on? <sighs> Gonna change your plans. Where you going? I'm gonna go to Dad's house. I left the key to the storage unit there. Ah, but... Yeah, look, I'm... Sorry, guys, right? Don't be. You're doing the right thing. Let's go. Did you tell us it was in the locker room? Yes, he did. All right, let's get this key. I don't envy you explaining this to the commissioner. Well, at least I'm up to speed with yesterday's discussions. You were right. A few shots of single malt and Stefano was singing like a canary. <laughs> well, if you like, I can put the good word in. They're always looking for female members. <laughs> that was a once-in-a-lifetime experience, Spitz. Where's Jordan? Rescue team leader, I've sighted the patient. She's been I repeat, Lara, we didn't catch the last bit. You are not going to believe this. Come and check it out. <laughs> oh, you've got to be joking. What a fruit. I'm coming up. Jordan, she wants you. Yeah, I bet she does. Leave her. If she can climb... Down, she can climb back up. That's a negative, Vince. She really is stuck. What's her mental state? She need a psych assessment? Yes. <laughs> Doubtful. I think she's just rich and bored and looking for a thrill. Base to rescue three portable. Jordan. Tell your admirer if she wants a thrill, I can have a charge with being a public nuisance. Yeah, copy that, Vince. Boss isn't happy. And the ex? Especially not happy. Can't be doing this, Kim. You were the one that said you couldn't fraternise outside of rescues. True. And this is the only place I get you to myself. Not the only place. Rescue 5 portable. Sit rep, Jordan. You ready? Bring us up. You all right? That's the way. OK. Easy does it. There we go. <sighs> Done a nose to toes. Bet you'd have. She's fine. Yeah, and what about you? Do we need to treat you for a crush injury? Sounds like you're the one with the crush. <laughs> you know what? Jordan can date whoever he wants. Just not crazy stalkers. What, like an overprotective ex who can't let go? It's not the best you've got. OK, we're done here. Yep. Stay out of trouble. No promises. Bye, George. 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 Leave her alone. <laughs> Rescue three portable to rescue four portable. You copy, Chase? 
Jordan, how's the groupie? Haha, <laughs> very funny, mate. Hey, listen, about that spare room. Wouldn't mind checking it out over lunch. Yeah, sure. Maintenance guy's got a key. I'll tell him you're coming. Sweet. Over. But you said this area was full of tossers. Can't live with me mum all my life. This is it. Piece of cake. Hey. That's my surfboard. You told me you lost it. <laughs> She's got my Phantom comics. Phantom? Yeah, guy still walks. It's awesome. He's a man in tights, that's all I'm saying. Yeah. Hey. How far away is Dad's place? Uh, 20 k's. Uh, I reckon we'll just bought us about 30 minutes, give or take. Come on, let's do it. Excuse the boxes, we only just moved in. No, I like it. Not at all what I expected. What'd you expect? I don't know. I thought you might be the kind of guy who lives with his mother. I'm kidding. It's cool. Very, um, minimalist. Oh, yeah, less is more. Hmm. So where's the bedroom? Down here. Just checking flatmates on home. Thank you, Chase. <laughs> no, 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 no. Leave it on. Look, he's a listening party, remember? Yeah, I remember. I wasn't want to turn the music off on you. Is it more for you? <laughs> under the kitchen sink. Dad must have cleaned the place out. Excuse me? We need to access Lachlan Gallagher's unit. You too. Ma'am. Ah. And what are they doing here? I don't know, maybe you lock in? We get them occasionally. All right. No more pissing about. You listen to me. The deal's off, you understand? You're going to jail. Question is, are your brothers going with you? Because I will make sure they do time for this. What's that? Let's go. You get me that memory stick. You don't think I got it? Let me talk to him. 
Dean, Chase, boys, come out. Boys, you know what you're doing? Go! Hold on. What are you doing? We're trying to help you. Ah, you're not Dean. You're going to stop it all up, mate. Look. Chase! Chase, you're not doing anyone really favours here, all right? Just give me the memory stick. So you can bury it like you buried Lockie's career? Oh, you and Dean have done that yourselves. Lockie could have had his old job back, but you have screwed that up. Yeah, you kind of did. Chase! What? Don't! Give ah. us the camera! Got her. She's got you wrapped around her stitch plate, doesn't she? Copy, Jordan. It's my job, Kim. Rescue three portable. Go ahead. Finally, where are you? I'm at Chase's checking out the view. We'll finish up. We'll be there in two minutes. Rescue two out. Copy that already. Our response times have fallen by 90 seconds in the past quarter, which is above the statistical mean. Um, the statistical mean... Continue, Mr Turno. Take your time. Yes, thank you. It's better be an emergency thing. There's been an accident involving Major Newell. Potential crush injury. This is big trouble for the Gallagher's, Michelle. We need you there. Right, no, no, no. I'll meet you there. Yep. Um, may I be excused, Commissioner? There's an urgent matter I need to attend to. It's not a matter of national security by any chance. I had a call this morning from a very indignant military investigator who went to great pains to tell me that you'd been extremely uncooperative in her inquiries. Just protecting my team, sir. They're threatening legal action. Uh, with all due respect, sir, she can stick her legal action. I will back my team against some trumped up witch hunt any day of the week. Michelle, in a few minutes, I have to make a very important decision. One of these teams will have to be closed down. Do you think it's wise to abandon your closing statement at this time? You got everything? Phone, keys? Yes, Jordan. Uh, can we make a bet? Yes. Goodbye, Jordan. Uh, uh, wait up. What? We're going to see each other again? Maybe when you're single. I am single. Keep telling yourself that. What is she doing here? I had to lay down the law. Just had to explain. Work and play doesn't mix. Some people just don't get it. Yeah, I guess not. One, two, three. Major Newell. Major Newell. Get her out, Gallagher. Claire. Major Newell, you, you hear me? Right? I can get back. We need to stabilise it first. I've got to make this right, bro. You're not going to make it right by killing yourself. Here. We've got a pulse, boys. All right, I got the spine board. Chase, get this site secure, OK? I want her out of here. Guys, guys, I need you to back off from me, OK? We'll take it from here. Just back off. Step over there. It's OK. Chase, Torch. Claire, can you hear me? It's Lockie. It's fastest response time in the state, my ass. It's good. Just hang in there. And you hear your brother tell you to back off? Sometimes you've got to bend the rules. All right, what do we got? She got lucky. Good radio polls, people's equal and reacting. I'm pretty sure she's just trapped. All right, Chase. Oxy Reva, let's get her out of here. Stay still. No, I, don't, I don't need it. I don't yeah, need you it. do. Just hang in there, Claire. You're doing well. A couple of minutes, we're going to have you out of here, OK? You see how far you get. Hey, hey! 
just just watch I need you to watch this and she's making out, but she'll live. And Lockie? No, it depends on her. She's got his future in her hands. And his past. Lockie, good to go. What to get you to an ambulance? Listen, I was wrong about you. You're not a coward. Or your mates. I'm gonna make sure my superiors know it. You show them this? You tell them about air support not coming? Orders are orders. But you've seen it. You know what happened, Claire. It doesn't mean I can do what I like. Lockie, we're army. We don't do what we're told. Everything goes pear-shaped. Right. Yeah. I understand. I guess it's lucky that I'm not army. Hey, Adam! Adam! Give it here. Back off. Back off. Back off. Right, anyone who is not rescued, clear out. You heard her? Piss off out of here. You're obstructing your rescue. Michelle! He talked some sense into your unit leader. He's about to bring a mountain of shit down onto your team. Get her out of here. Michelle! Michelle! Just hand over the camera now. All right. Prepare to lift. The army is not going to let this go. You have not heard the end of this. Bye. Yeah, we'll see you soon. We'll be waiting. Why did you do that? Because we made the stupid decision to hire you, and unfortunately, that makes you rescue. And she was very rude, Lockie. No, but Michelle, I appreciate the support, but they will bury us. Well, not if we strike first. Go over their heads, talk to the people who make the orders. Make a copy first, damn it. Right, we're done here. Debrief when we get back. <clears throat> and you, my brother. Hey. Cara Bishop, you're 11, huh? Oh, no, that was, um... I want my surfboard back as well. Hey, and is that you and Tara in the other video that we found in the shed? Because that, that is weird. <laughs> you run. You run. I'm right now. Come on, mate. It's 200 bucks a week. It's a bargain. Yeah, not if we're all unemployed tomorrow. Oh, you should do it, Jordan. I'm sure the chicks will dig it. I leave my mum's plasma, no way. Good news? Not for DeStefano, no. The commissioner axed his unit. That sucks. Yeah, I'm gonna go for a consolation drink with him later. Oh. What? I discovered I'd like single malt whiskey. Right. We still have jobs. Everyone's a winner. Hey! You guys sound Very nice. A little bit overdressed, brother. It's just a debrief. Got myself a date with the Colonel Victoria Barracks. I'm gonna show him this and make sure he watches it. And just don't punch this one, okay? Yeah. Save some pizza, I'll see you soon. I hope so. Ah. You don't know.